My name is Mark Goedkoop. I'm the founder and owner and director of uh, Prey Consultancy in the Netherlands. Prey Consultants is uh, focusing entirely on putting metrics behind sustainability. So what we developed in 1990 already was CIMA Pro, one of the first LCA tools available on the market. So the key of the tool is it's a data management tool for you, it's a modeling tool and it helps you to interpret what you have been doing. CIMA Pro is regarded very powerful, especially because it's so transparent, especially because it can handle great amounts of data and it has a very good set of databases with it, they come for free with it. Essentially, life cycle ass assessment is a methodology which allows one to look at environmental impacts of one or more products throughout the entire life cycle. So from the extraction of raw materials, throughout the production, use phase, and then to the disposal of the product. Yeah, my name is Lex Roos. Um, I'm a PhD. I have a lot of experience on uh, life cycle assessment of uh, nanotechnology based products. The nice thing about LCA is that you can really assess any product on environmental impacts. So Simon Pro is actually a combination of um, a database and a software program that can calculate. And especially the database function is really, really useful. In Simon Pro you can make a model of the product that you want to analyze. And it has a huge database uh, which you can use to build your model and that already contains a lot of environmental data which then is used to calculate the impacts. My name is Li Shen. I work at the Agricultural Economic Institute of Wageningen University in the Netherlands. I'm involved in the Sustainability Consortium and I'm there I'm also doing a lot of LCA work. If you're a manufacturing company it's, it's so important these days to in, involve LCA in the early stage of your product design. Well, CIMA Pro, first of all, is a very good database tool. And on top of that, um, it's a very good modeling tool. So without these kind of tools and database nowadays, it's impossible to, to perform, to conduct an LCA in a short time. What's most important is that people get an insight into uh, where the environmental hotspots in their product, uh, the production process is. So they, they learn uh, what the influence of producing their product and the use of their product and uh, throwing away of the product is on the environment. Every LCA that I do, I learned a little bit more and I think that a lot of people come with preconceived ideas about what will be bad. For example, transport is a bad guy and what I realize is that still with the experience that I have, I get surprised every time I do it and I learn a little bit more. We are very much in the area where we think transparency is key that we should be very open about what we're doing. The data is well documented. You can actually change everything. You can go into everything and you are not create, there's no dependency from us or our consultants. Einstein is quoted saying, things should be as simple as possible, but not any simpler than that. And that's basically the guideline for LCA.